posting the pictures Trying to look like you winning I'm writing rhymes in the kitchen Soaking in moments we live in, yeah You got the nerve to be on me Faking your life for the hygiene If you got my number, don't add me Cause baby Hey Taurus, it's Purple Haze, and I'm back to shine a positive light on your dark days. Okay, um, <laughs> I'm here to do a reading for you guys. You already know we're going to start off with um, general, then we're going to do love, and then you and your person all signs. Y'all know how that go. Okay, so let's go ahead and get started. I don't want to waste no time. Um, let's do this sage spray real quick. Purple Haze Sage Spray. Um, go to the description box .com, Description box .com. Go to the description box down below. <laughs> um, okay, so let's go ahead and get to it. Thank you, God. Thank you, universe. And thank you, ancestors, for all that you do and all that you will do. For every lesson is a blessing. Please continue to shine your positive light on me as well as the Tauruses listening to this particular reading. Okay? Now, we good? We good. Okay. Taurus. Is this in the way? I don't want nothing in the way, child. I don't want nothing looking crazy. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to start off with what I say, general. Yeah, I did say general. Yes. Let's start off with that and then work our way, um, you know, into everything else. So, really quick. Let's see. If y'all hear any background noise, um, most likely it's my kids. But we should be good, okay? Let's start off with a general reading for Taurus. Okay. We have... Yes. Okay, we have the Ten of Swords, okay? Page of Swords. Hmm. And Four of Pentacles. Okay, so... Taurus, it seems to me that you guys are finally taking a stand what i mean by that is you guys have gone through so much okay you've been through so much taurus you you feel like you deserve more and not only do you feel like you deserve more you're ready to take on whatever you already learned your lesson in the past whatever it is that went wrong who hurt you who betrayed you who did all these things to you and you might have felt like even you had bad luck at some point um but now you feel like okay instead of me looking at those situations as um you know Instead of, instead of you looking at the situation as just trouble, you're taking it as a lesson learned and you feel like it prepared you for the worst, whatever it is that's going to come, okay? Then you have the Four of Pentacles, okay? You have the Four of Pentacles as well. Not only are you are ready for a new challenge, ready for a new start, it seems as if because you're prepared, because you're ready... Things are going to start flowing more towards you. If you had experienced some financial ruin in the past, Taurus, I feel like you're going to gain it back um, because of your new attitude. You have you have your mind set on something specific and you're going to get it, okay? You are definitely going to get it. Um, let's keep it going with this one. Okay. Let's do one more to keep it even. There we go. Thank you okay yeah so king of pentacles like i said you did suffer quite a lot some of you suffered a, a big loss okay there are some of you who took that loss and you're learning from it there's there's a little bit of you who are on your way you might not feel as confident right now but you will my bad so yeah some of you experienced quite a loss there's some of you who are prepared for whatever prepared to move on from the situation but at the same time there are some of you who are not quite there, but you will be. So don't get discouraged. Your time is coming. You have the two of wands in reverse here. Um, not only did you already got your mind set up on what you want and how you're going to go about it, Taurus, you refuse to go backwards. It's like you got your mind made up and there's no one that's going to change your mindset at this point. Then you have the Knight of Cups, okay? You have the Knight of Cups. So there's still room for those of you who feel like you don't have time for romance. That's not true. There's still room for that. And you obviously, you're thinking about it. You crave the attention. You crave some romance, Taurus. 
Um, but sometimes you feel like you either don't have time or you feel like there's always something standing in the way. So for those of you who are single and you feel like something's always standing in the way, um, like I said, there is room for love. There is room for that. Do not continue to doubt that. Don't even put that energy out there, okay? Um, but yeah, let's go ahead and move on to <laughs> the love. Okay, let's get to the, the good stuff. Okay, let's see what's going on with you guys as far as love goes. That's the way you love okay, let's see. King of Cups in reverse, Nine of Pentacles. Okay, so you you are having trouble balancing the two. When it comes to your work or your job or your money, for some of you, you kind of have trouble balancing the two, okay? Um, you have the King of Cups in reverse, the Nine of Pentacles, the Nine of Cups, and then the Knight of Pentacles. You also have a lot of Pentacles in your reading as well. So some of you are either dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, um, another Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn, okay? Um, but yeah, like I said, there is room. You are able to balance the two. You just have to believe in that. You're, uh, then you have the Nine of Pentacles and the Nine of Cups. You're on the right path, Taurus, when it comes to what you want and how you're going to go about it. The more you balance yourself and the more you have con confidence in all areas, the more you will bring that positivity towards you, okay? Um, don't, sweat, don't sweat any financial ruin. If you guys have experienced any type of loss, or do you feel like money is not coming fast enough? Try your hardest not to rush the process. Um, something is telling me to tell y'all not to rush it. Okay? Don't don't rush it. The more you want it, talk about it. The more you discuss it. The more you keep, 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 keep thinking about it. The further away it's going to be. So try your hardest not to really think about it. And just be. Just be in the moment. Just be you. Just continue to focus on everything. Okay? Um... Let's move on to the energy oracle cards, and then we're going to do you and your personal signs. So let's pull one card that we can take from this particular reading. Okay, one card we can take from this particular reading. Um, so let's pull one card from the deck um, to take one message or whatever cards they give us from this particular reading. Let's see the message that we're going to take away from it as far as the general part walking away okay so there are some of you who are going to be walking away from a situation to make it bigger okay so for those of you who had took a loss maybe you guys have lost a job some of you probably walked away from a, one particular job because you took the courage to do that i feel like that's why it's a part of you gaining your confidence at first you're going to feel down about it but then eventually um you're going to realize it was best for you let's pull a romantic oracle card so see one card to take away from the message as far as you know what no what am i doing we're going to end that so we're going to end that as far as yeah we're going to end that as far as that let's pull one you know, romantic oracle card to see the love message to take away from this particular reading um any messages oh we got two that came out so we have keep an open mind okay and we have religious factor in reverse, okay? So, hmm, for some of you, you're dealing with someone who probably is spiritual, someone who has a different belief than your usual type. There's someone who believes in something or they're dibbling and dabbling in something that um, you may not um, understand. I'll just say that. You may not understand, but... Try to keep an open mind for some of you. It does not mean that this person, you should just write them off right away. Um, your soulmate could be somebody that you least expect. It could be someone who you feel like is not your type. Maybe you're used to tall men, but your soulmate might be somebody slightly taller than that. Like, sometimes we can't be too picky. I would just say you never know who your soulmate might be for those of you who are single. Um, you never know who it might be. For those of you who are in a relationship... Here we go, child. I think it was only one card, yeah. So for those of you who are in a relationship, finances and career, okay? So 
there are some of you who are missing that spark, that fire. And it has a lot to do with work. It has a lot to do with work and finances. It didn't go your way. It's, it didn't go your way as far as work or finances. But just because it, it's not going your way doesn't mean that you should neglect the partner that you're with. Some of you are neglecting your partner because you're so busy working. But that's okay. You just have to, like I said earlier, learn to balance the two. Okay? Try not to neglect the other you know you could have both you could have you could have your your work and your career and you could have love it's all about balance and it's also about that person supporting you okay now let's do you and your person all signs taurus you and your person all signs let's start off with taurus and taurus taurus and taurus okay we got separation Okay, and then we have make the effort in reverse, okay? So for some of you, um, Taurus, dealing with another Taurus, Taurus number one, you feel like maybe you need some time apart or maybe you guys are taking some time apart. Um, and your Taurus that you're dealing with, they're no longer making the effort. That's probably why you decided to call it quits. You feel like they're not, they're not working as hard as you would like them to. Um, Taurus and Gemini. Okay. Taurus. Gemini. One card for... Oh, okay. So, Taurus has finance and career in reverse. Okay, so at first, work and money was an issue between you two, but it looks like it's going to be dwelling down. Gemini has wedding. They're thinking about a major commitment when it comes to you. The overall energy between the both of you is attraction. You guys have a deep attraction to each other, enough to make you guys want to commit, okay? Um... Let's do Taurus and Cancer. Taurus and Cancer, how do you two feel about one another? Okay. Let's see. Taurus and Cancer. Oh, but pull another one. Taurus, this could be the one. Okay, you feel like there's a chance that Cancer might be the one for you. On their end, they are making the effort. So, them making the effort, is it, that turns you on. You like the fact that they, they kind of keep their word. They mean what they say. Because of that, you have faith in you guys is relationship, okay? Taurus and um, oh, child, what I just do? Uh, Taurus and Leo. <laughs> Taurus, okay. Let's see, Leo. Oh, Taurus, you have oh, calling in your soulmate. Leo has wedding, so you guys are probably in a um stage where you guys are not totally committed. So you're probably thinking about getting more serious. Some of you are thinking about getting married. Um, a lot of you are thinking about making this situation permanent, okay? Taurus and Virgo. Two cards for Taurus and Virgo. Taurus, Virgo. Taurus, you have unrequited love, okay? So you're probably dealing with someone who you feel like is not in a, a lot of chemistry between you two, but they feel like it's worth waiting for. They feel like the reason why you think they're not that they're not your type is because you have your eyes on someone else. Maybe some of you are still stuck on an ex. Taurus and, uh, I'm going so fast, child. what I just do? <laughs> Taurus and Virgo. Taurus. Okay, Virgo. Taurus has pay attention to the red flags in reverse. Okay. So, some of you, um, you saw this as a red flag, but now you're kind of trying to be more understanding. Virgo, um, that, that you're dealing with, has deception here. They come off as a liar. You're trying to understand them, though. For some reason, you it's like you see the potential in them, but they are they come off as a, a liar. Um, Taurus and Libra, how do you two feel about one another? Taurus, trust with the first. Taurus has trust issues. You're having an issue trusting your Libra. Libra has honeymoon in reverse. Maybe you're not trusting them because you guys aren't having a lot of sex as much as you would like to. Taurus and Scorpio. How do you two feel about one another? Taurus has flirt. Okay. Um, who did I say? Scorpio. Okay. Scorpio has calling in your soulmate in reverse. Okay. So I don't think you two are pretty serious. It might be some type, some of you might be having an affair with a Scorpio or you guys are 
in a situation where nobody knows you guys are dealing with each other. But there's a lot of flirting going on. I don't think you guys are in, at a point where you feel like this person is your soulmate as of yet. Um, Taurus and Sagittarius, how do you two feel about one another? Taurus and Sagittarius, codependency. Taurus, you find yourself feeling addicted to Sagittarius. Sagittarius, um, this is someone that you've de dealt with in the past, so you find it hard to let them go. You're having trouble letting Sagittarius go or vice versa. Um, the overall energy is pay attention to the red flags, okay? So, try not to be blinded by the fact that you're addicted or attached to this particular Sagittarius because take your heart out of it and think with your mind and try to pay attention to the red flags. Um, Taurus and Capricorn, how do you two feel about one another Taurus has stay optimistic about your love life Capricorn calling in your soulmate in reverse a lot of y'all are just not taking things seriously stay optimistic okay so about your love life think positive when it comes to Capricorn no they're not considering committing to you right now but try not to think that as a negative thing like we all have our reasons why we don't want to jump and commit okay Taurus and Aquarius, how do you two feel about one another? Taurus has expressed your love. Aquarius has deception in reverse. So at first you found it hard to express yourself to Aquarius because they came off very deceitful. It was always an excuse. They were they exaggerated a lot. But um now you're now you feel like you're gonna go ahead and be more expressive and like take that chance, take that leap, because now you see the truth when it comes to Aquarius. Maybe that's what make you more attracted to them. Um, Taurus and Pisces. Okay. Taurus has retreat in reverse. Pisces has, it is safe for you to love. So Taurus, um, a part of you that is, some of you are unsure on whether or not you should go on a date with Pisces. Um, you're not sure if you wanna be alone with them yet. Some of you that are in a relationship, um, you aren't really, you guys are in a relationship, but you're not seeing eye to eye right now, but they're trying to convince you that it is still safe for you to stay, you know, within the picture, okay? Taurus and Aries. Last one, child. Taurus and Aries. How do you two feel about one another? Taurus. Worth waiting for in reverse, okay, and... What else did I say? <laughs> Aries, right? Aries. Yeah, that's probably one of the last one. Okay, so you feel like you're getting very impatient when it comes to your Aries Taurus because they are flirtatious and they seem like they are for the streets. <laughs> you feel like Aries is for the streets, therefore you don't want to wait for them no more. You don't want to deal with that right now. You're tired of people being for the streets. You're looking for something else and Aries might not be giving that to you, okay? That's what I have for you guys, Taurus. I hope you enjoyed this particular reading. Um, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like the video. Make sure you comment. I do enjoy reading the comments. I am the type that replies to comments and stuff like that. So go ahead and do your thing. Um, and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh, can't even see you. I will see you guys in the next one, okay? Bye. Serene and pure and free